Hello everyone, welcome to the 23rd video of my Civilization 5 Brave New World Let's Play playing as the Inca Civilization So during the last video I brought some of my artillery pieces into range of Delhi and the rest of them should get into range within a turn or two I think uh, If I'm remembering correctly I actually upgraded them from cannons as well in the last video So Delhi shouldn't last too long now uh, it shouldn't be too long before I take it, as long as these musket man men can stay alive long enough to actually take the city. I've also moved this great engineer down in between videos. Uh, it was up here before. I may make the Brandenburg Gate in Delhi, perhaps. It has Alhambra already, so it would be an amazing uh, troop or uh, unit making city, potentially. It's got a lot of mines and hills around here as well. Not entirely sure if I'm going to do that yet though. It would take quite a while for it to uh, get back into shape I think after I take it. I may, I'd have to annex it as well. Uh, also, I've changed some of the... Well I was... I did have a couple of cities that had great scientists in. I've taken them out now. Uh, the main reason is I don't really need them I think because science is really good. Arts funding is in place, so it takes a lot longer to get great scientists anyway. And yeah, I'd much rather have my cities building infrastructure or military units than getting extra great scientists now. Okay, right, I think that's it for the turn, so next turn. Okay, Kamehameha just completed the Red Fort. I've actually lost a musketman as well. Wasn't expecting that. Right, that could be an issue. If he's taking out my musketman, I'm not going to be able to take the city, perhaps. This great wool could have, uh, could cause quite a few problems. I've got a knight and a cavalry unit up there. Actually, going to upgrade that this turn as well. Actually, I'll hold off to see if I need the money for a city-state. Right, Polynesia's just going to be a lot harder to take the cities. Um... That's not good. They've actually made peace, uh, Polynesia and Denmark. And it looks like they may have given them um, that city in a peace deal. Uh, I actually bribed Polynesia to declare war on Denmark, so it couldn't have been that long ago. Maybe it was the minimum amount of turns, about 10 turns. So what's Polynesia's military like? They're actually a tiny bit ahead of me now, but I doubt they've got artillery yet. Uh, even though they are head tech wise. Right, I'm not going to put a spy back into the city though. Right, so Kathmandu wants a natural wonder. There's probably at least one left somewhere. Bogota, well, we've actually split that three way. So we all got influence for that. Tory piece completed in, in uh, Cusco. Uh, trade route, way on there. Uh, right, so do the workers first. I actually want to build a road down to Delhi, so I'm going to start on that. So I'll work in hills first, as usual. Uh, this worker probably needs to bring down towards that silk, or I could help out with the roads. Do I have silk now? I think I do, after reconnecting that. Yeah, I may work on the road first, potentially, here. Um, yeah, I think I will. I need to be getting over to Copenhagen as quickly as possible, so I need to get my military back in a bit after taking Delhi. Um, okay, this unit can move there. Pikeman's exploring up here still. Uh, move there. What am I going to use this worker for? There's some furs up here which I could definitely use a worker. Uh, have for, be useful to have a worker working up there in a bit. I think most of these tiles are done now over here. I could be making trading posts on these farm tiles perhaps, but I wouldn't mind the city growing a bit, arguably. Uh, yeah, I think I'll bring this worker back there. Right, so 
Gotta be careful here. Let's caravan and could potentially pillage. Right, the sooner, first of all, I'm gonna pillage that. And I'm gonna bring him. Right, so his promotions give me 30%, so slightly better than a. That's Forest's 25% defense bonus, so it's best that, better for me to be on the flat terrain, I think. So bring him there. I can only move one. I've got half movement because of the Great Wall. This unit is very vulnerable. Uh, I'm going to bring him towards that crossbowman, I think. I may shoot at that crossbowman just so the muskman doesn't get attacked so much. Not sure yet. Right, bring that there. Satirate piece can move down to there. Uh, right, so that one. If I bring it there, it becomes in range of the city. Okay. Bring that one across. That one across. That one across. So I've got four in range next turn. Uh, great general. Should probably bring. There's nothing to pillage over here. I uh, guess I'll bring that down to there. I can heal up. Till a piece can make his way down. Yeah, I may have to build some cavalry units or something to take the city. If I can bring two cavalry units uh, into range of the city on the same turn, they're not going to be able to kill both. Like right, this Lancer. Can. Uh, it's going to be hard to get down here actually. Uh, so, where can I get? What tile can I get to here? I can bring it to there. Great engineer can make his way down. I think I'm about to get a cold, I think, so hopefully you can't notice that too much, but uh might be sniffling a bit. Great engineer can go down there. General to there. General can stay there. Right production. Uh so well manga completed the university, I'm not gonna put population points into uh, what you want to call it? Great scientist. Uh, harbour is that useful for this city? I don't think I have any trade routes coming from here yet, but I might in a bit. I'm going to make the opera house. Uh, speaking of right, national wonders. What do I need? Markets. Right. Choose production. Artillery piece just got done there. Going to make the national epic. Uh, let's finish the armory. Military academy takes absolutely ages. I don't think I'll build those. Not sure if I'm going to go on and now. It's quite. F uh, we'll take a lot of social policies to get deep into the honor tree to uh, get this one, for example. Half price uh, barracks, armies, military academies. So, what shall I build? I think I build a unit. I build a cavalry. Okay. And Machu completes the opera house. I shall build a barracks. Okay. And on to Tambo. Can I make the Armory. Right, so next turn. Hopefully, I don't lose a musket man now. Right, so one got a bit damaged, but they're fine. Great person was born. Planet is another caravan. Uh, okay, so yet another great artist. 
we've got three now, but there's uh, a wandering deli that gives extra 50% for golden ages, so I'm going to save it for save these up for that, I think. Uh, this artillery piece can mix it to there. Peace treaty with the Byzantines ended. Someone stole acoustics. My spies aren't doing a very good job of stopping people from stealing. Hanoi gave me a unit. Gatling gun. Um, I'm not sure what promotions my Gatling guns have. That's flat, rough, rough, I guess I go uh, flat terrain. Or open terrain. Okay, let's get these works done. Uh, that one can move to there. Put that road. Go road there. We're actually going to stay there for a minute. Alright, this is making a road down to Copenhagen still. I think I'll continue it all the way down to there. Might get rid of this in the future, but it's not going to cost me much gold because of the Incan special ability. Uh, this worker. What tiles that? I repair that. Move up there. Right. One manga. Let's tile up there. I need to do. Um, this may become a production city. Maybe. May want it to. So I'm not sure I want to chop down these lumber mills, for example. I may want to, or forest, I should say, uh, make lumber mills instead. Uh, this unit can um, I'm not sure what to do with this unit. Could bring it over here potentially. Right, there's a missionary over there. Just spotted. I have to go and get that actually. I've no idea how the Russians are creating so much faith in this game. The amount of missionaries they've had has been crazy. Right, this unit can move to there. Uh, this can come back down here. Can terrace farm. Okay, right, so I think it's time to right, pillage that tile first. Oh, has it been pillaged? Yes, it has. It, I just pillaged a road. So I just wasted a move. Well, I ah, should be right. Uh, I can only move one tile here anyway. Right, so this unit can pillage and move next to the city, I believe. Uh, there or there, though. Probably here. Uh, where's the crossbowman gone? Did he retreat? Must have. Right, that unit can move to there. Yeah, there he is. Uh, that can pillage. Move to there. Uh, probably need to move this away. That unit's going to get killed. I'm not sure I can prevent it. Let's have moved this artillery piece. Um, I'm not sure I want to either. Right, so let's get attacking the city anyway. So, take Delhi. And I can. I can't even heal now because I've pillaged this turn, so I really messed up with that. Uh, so if I move to there, the city can attack. If I stay there, two crossbowmen can attack it. Uh, if I move there, that guy can't shoot it because the forest in the way. I move it back to there. Uh, cargo ships returned. Polynesia denounced Denmark. That's good for me. I should arguably try and get... Denmark or Polynesia into another war, but I don't think I can go to spend money on that. Uh, right, so cargo routes. 
I don't believe any city state wants a trade. Route? No. Okay, so the best route is Huamanga to Adrianople. I don't really mind giving them extra money on science, it's not like they're going to really do anything with it. So, change home city. Huamanga. Uh, this artillery piece. Uh, maybe I should start to bring units over to Copenhagen now. So I think that's the quickest route through that road network I've built over there. Yeah, so I bring it to there. A great engineer can uh, come down here. Should be safe there. I heal up. This cavalry I'll send over to Danish lands as well. Uh, that great general is. Right, that one can move to there. Next, stay there. Right, so next turn. Right, did anyone grow this turn? Match you did, I think. Uh, yeah, I'll put that on there, I think. Okay. Right, next turn. So it looks like Delhi's going to be taking this turn. Now I've got. Yeah, that musket. Uh, Gatling gun. Architecture did die. begins where engineering ends. Right, so Hermitage, Porcelain Tower now available. I've nearly got enough opera houses, I think. Uh, Taj Mahal, I think, has already been built. And if it's he's definitely been built. Okay, that got, gun got really badly damaged as well. Right, so if I take Delhi this turn, are they going to be able to retake it? I can't see any melee type units over here, so probably not. I was killed there. Uh, Denmark entered Industrial. Vilnius also wants Natural Wonders. So I probably need. They're probably out to see it somewhere, some natural wonder is. Right, let's do this first then. Uh, so, how many votes are there? 6, 13, 17 votes they've got against me, all the other saves. Now, cultural heritage sites, I think, well, Delhi still has its capital, so I assume it's going to vote based on that this turn, even if I take its capital this turn. So I think what I'm going to do is actually split my votes. I'd be surprised if this doesn't get through with seven votes. Uh, if say, well, he's going to be voting for World's Fair since that's his. He's probably going to be voting for cultural heritage sites as well. It's possible these three would vote against it, so that's six votes. So I think seven might be enough to get it through. And I actually want to vote against this. Uh, reason being. I don't want to be spending production on getting extra culture or a free social policy at the moment. I'd much rather be getting up infrastructure or building more military units. So I'm going to say nay to that. Uh, don't care if it angers anyone, like Polynesia. Uh, so I'm expecting to get that through, and I probably won't uh, get this through as nay. But you never know. Right, so commit delegates. And, right, let's move some units around. Right, let's finish the road. I'm going to build this road, build a road there, and there's some hills down there, so I'll use those for a road for Delhi as well. Okay. Uh, what's left? Right, this guy can make lumber mill there. This cargo ship, established trade route, uh, so Adrianople. Uh, what's left? Right, workers. Over there. Uh, if I move there, I don't think I can see anything more, so I won't. Still at war with Moscow. As long as they're making missionaries, I'm going to be. Staying at war with them, frankly. Right, Babylon camp all the way over there. 
Uh, right, speaking of missionaries, I'll take that. And this worker can uh, make his way. What else is this city using? Come down here somewhere. Not sure if I've got a worker over at the capital at the moment, but it doesn't really need me doing any more tiles over there for the bit, I think. Right, that can pillage. Anywhere else that I want to pillage? Don't think so. Uh, right, let's attack Delhi then. So, which are the best? Right, that unit can only attack Delhi, so I'll attack with that. Same with this one. And that one can attack cannons. Right, so that's a rough train promotion. That's a city and rough. It's a light train promotion. I'll attack that. And I think I'll attack this one next. Alright, so Delhi can be taken now. Uh, do I want to take it now? This is the question. Probably. Alright, so... I've got 14 happiness. There's tons of wonders in this city, though. So, let's have a look. All of those. Uh, probably some happiness there somewhere. Right, so I'll take Delhi. Three great works taken. Uh, right, so view city. Right, two great writing. And a great piece of music. So Alhambra's going to be great for making troops. That's nice, but nothing special. That's, I think Chichen Itza is local happiness rather than global, but good nonetheless. Uh, that's going to be great for my great artists for creating golden ages, though. Uh, great library. Great wall. I'm not sure there is much happiness here, actually. Taj Mahal's can't remember if that's local or global either. Uh, right, and we fit see. Right, so quick puppet. Right, so probably should move some of these around. India's or Delhi's not going to be creating any culture until it comes out of anarchy. So, uh, that to what city? Match you. I've got two bits of writing as well. I shall right Moscow. I want it to get some furs that are near to it, so I'll put a great work of writing there to increase the culture. And this one can just go to there, I think. Right. Might put them back in Delhi eventually though. Right, so they've got marble nearby. They've lost the capital. So, we've got two more capitals to go now. Uh, right, this unit can attack that crossbowman. Should probably bring a great general down. Uh, not sure if I'm going to make peace with India, India quite yet. Might kill some of their units before I do that. Uh, this can attack that cannon. Right, can I get anything over here? No, I don't think so. Uh, right, let's do the production for the turn. Right, that's completed barracks. I'll make the market next. Uh, right, so I'm just going to figure out if I want to make peace or not. Okay, I think I am actually going to make peace with India now. I don't think there's any real reason to stay at war with them. I can start trading with them again if I make peace, so I'll negotiate peace. He'll give me Vijay and Nagra, but I don't think that's actually... Well, if I was to take it off him, then I'd probably raise it, because I don't think it's a particularly good city. So, and it's not one I would want, really. It would increase my... Uh, tech costs. So the problem is if I was to take it though I'd probably go over my happiness limit since I'd be raising the city so I don't think I will take it. Uh, I'll just get what I can get which is probably not an awful lot. 
I'll take your gold, take your embassy, take your copper if you'll give it to me. And yeah, he will actually. And he should, well he's got enough cities huh? to actually earn some money in a bit, so I'll be, be able to sell my goods back to him. Uh, right, so, make peace. And just uh, some trades I believe I can do. Right, I've got excess silks now, even though it's not really showing up here. Could sell for dyes, probably not actually because it's hostile. Uh, right, so I'll sell this for three. Well, he really hates us. I guess I'll take two. Not sure it's worthwhile at that amount though. Uh, by sand times, we've got a setter up here as well, I've noticed. Uh, I don't think I have any of those excess. Will you... Oh, will you give me three for that? No. Try to sell it for two. No, I should actually do that. Uh, I've got one horse left, which I probably can't sell to anyone. Right, so this unit, everyone's off to Copenhagen now. Uh, so I believe this is the quickest route. Right. Up to there. Cavalry can come down there. Uh, that can move back into my territory. Put that there. I've got a bit of an issue actually. Copenhagen shouldn't be too hard to take, but defending it from sea down here is going to be very difficult. So I'd have to get. Well, I'd have to probably annex it and make some ships there quite quickly. Um, if I was at war with Polynesia at the same time, basically. And I'd have to get to Honolulu somehow, so I'm not quite sure how I'm going to do that. I'd have to take Ribe. If I took Ribe, I'd have to raise it properly, because it would be at risk of them taking it back. So then off to Tonga and Honolulu. I think that's what I'll be doing. Uh, could be tricky though. So I think tech wise I've got to head for railroads now. Just so I can move my units quicker. Uh, right, so this general. Can make his way to there. Lancer can go over here. Not sure exactly when I'm going to be to clear more Denmark actually trade into me quite a bit so uh, with this great engineer as well I think I'm gonna make the Brandenburg Gate in Alonte Tambo it's probably my most uh, most production of any of my cities apart from the capital uh, at least potential wise getting Delhi back up the ships gonna take too long uh, to be making melt units there uh, that's can move to there uh, how much Right, for Great Engineer rushing on standard speed, you get 300 as a base and 30 production per population. So that's 450, is it? Add 300, 750 exactly, if I rushed a Great Wonder there. And I think the Brandenburg Gate is 750 actually as well. Yeah, so I've got enough to do that in one turn. So I won't start making it now. Uh, this can make its way down here. And right, done for the turn. Not sure if any place grew this turn. Uh, I've got a thousand gold now. Uh, I'm actually going to protect Vilness as well. Might find that natural wonder in a bit. Um, yeah, I think I'll hold off from getting any more city states for the time being. Right, so next turn. I've got a great right. Uh, I could use my artists now to create a golden age. I think I might actually. Not sure where I'd be saving them up for otherwise. I get a golden age actually very soon because of happiness. How many turns is that? I think I might hold off on the uh, great artist then until I get this a normal happiness golden age. And probably for the end of this game, I'm going to be constantly in Golden Ages after that kicks in. Right, so we've got Copper. It's 
looks places are happy. Uh, Sophia, the one religious thing with them. Colombo of Connecticut Copper. Bogota wants a trade route. I could probably do that in a bit. India denounced Denmark. That's great. Philcast just grew. Down there. That's proposals. World's Fair was passed. There was eight votes against it and nine votes for it. Cultural Heritage Sites was passed as well. So that's a bit unlucky. If I'd have put one more vote into that, I probably would have got gotten it not to pass. Uh, yeah, it's four against that. I've got a crazy amount of wonders now, though. Right, that's artillery piece. Got a promotion. Tip folly. I can make a proposal. Uh, I think I'm probably about to be go over time actually, so I'm going to call this an end of uh, the video here. And in the next video, I'll figure out the proposal and move all of my units down to Copenhagen. Okay, so thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.